Hi, I'm Gia, and I'm Yarn Nuts, <laughs> Yarn Hoarder, Yarn Squirreler. In fact, I love yarn so much that I started my own online yarn store called YarnNut.com. We have Hobium yarns and Ice yarns shipping from the USA with no order minimums. So you can buy just a couple of balls, or you can buy what you need for your larger knitting and crochet projects. I am not affiliated with any yarn company. I purchase all this yarn myself for resale on my online yarn store. I get that question asked a lot. What do I do with all that yarn? And no, I don't get to keep it. I have to ship it out to customers. I do get to keep a little bit, but I don't get to keep it all, unfortunately. <laughs> I also use the yarn for yarn unboxing videos. I use it for yarn reviews, and I also use it for yarn giveaways. Don't forget about those tote bags full of yarn I like to give away, and there is another one coming up soon. I am so grateful to be part of the YouTube yarn and crochet community. Everyone has been so warm and welcoming and supportive of my new business. I really appreciate it. Thank you. So I'm not sure where the idea came in that my husband was a part of Yarn Nut. Um, he is extremely supportive and he is amazing, but this business is my own. I started it. I do all the video editing, the video filming. I built the website myself. I ship out the orders, order the yarn. It's all me. So when I'm talking to someone in the bloopers on the camera and I say cut, I'm really talking to myself so I know where to cut the video easily. <laughs> but not to take anything away from him, he puts up with me constantly talking about yarn. And of course, there's yarn all over the house. So <laughs> he is amazing. So thank you for that, sweetie. <laughs> so today I'm going to show you a bunch of new yarns from Ice Yarns that just came out within the last month or so. And I want to show you what they look like and hopefully will inspire some of your winter crochet projects. I'm also going to show you some yarn that is not new, but it is very hot this month. And I thought you would like to know what was popular. So sit back and grab a snack and enjoy this yarn movie. Brand new ice yarn called Puzzle Baby. I was thrown a, for a loop by these colors when I opened this package. It was, they're just so beautiful. I'm really happy to see that ice is starting to do some larger skeins of yarn. So I think that they are really trying to put yarn in larger skeins, which makes it a better value for everybody. So that's really great. Puzzle Baby, this is a two-way fine. 200 gram skein and 100% acrylic. It has all these gorgeous colors. They have really a lot of nice colorways, but I think I was feeling blue because of fall coming and win winter coming. So these bright colors really spoke to me. I thought that this would make something really happy. Greens, pinks, turquoises, white, yellow, coral. I mean, you name it, it's in here and it is just really amazing. I'm going to pull some out of the middle of the skein so you can see it. Yarn vomit. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Look at those colors. Just gorgeous. Super soft. Brilliant colors. I give this yarn an A++. I can't wait to make a baby play blanket out of this or make a really nice sweater, jacket, um, a little dress. So fun. Let's take a look at the fibers up close. As you can see, a very tiny amount of fuzz. Nicely twisted. It looks to me to be a little bit fatter than a two weight. This yarn is beautiful. This is the Ice Yarns Superwash Merino Wool. This is a 100 gram ball. It is 100% superwash merino wool. It's really soft. Um, I wouldn't say super, super soft just because of the wool, but it's not irritating at all. There's very little fuzz on it. Beautiful. Let's take a look at the fiber here. Very nicely woven, almost no fuzz at all. This is another large skein for you. This is a 150 gram skein of Harmony Alpaca. I love this color, Pinky Coral. It's another one of my favorites to go along with the gold this season. This is a four medium weight and it is, I will put the material up on the screen because I cannot read this label. 
the percentages are cut off, but it's really super, super soft. I just love this. Well, let's take a look at the close-up. As you can see, there's corals and pinks and taupes in here. This is just, oh, this would make such a cozy little scarf or wrap. It's really hard to pick which yarns to use. Let's take a look at the fiber. There's a fair amount of fuzz. It's super, super soft, not irritating at all. This is gorgeous yarn. Here is another new yarn that is great for the holidays. I love this Midnight Blue Sparkle. This is a new yarn called Elegant Metallic Cotton, and it is a two weight fine. It's 50 gram ball. It is looks to be 88% cotton, 12% metallic lurex. They have a lot of different colors. I just really gravitated toward this beautiful blue. It has a blue metallic thread running through it, as you can see. Which And the sparkle is just amazing. Look at that. It looks to be chain spun, so it definitely won't split on you. Here is what it looks like. There's no fuzz at all. Nice and clean and very sophisticated looking. Look at that. That is just beautiful. Let's see how much shine we can show you with this light. There you go. It's very, very sparkly. Look at that. Wow. Love it. Yes, another blue-gray yarn. <laughs> Definitely one of my favorite colors. This is Mohair Bulky. And this is 5% mohair, 10% wool, and 85% acrylic. This is a five-weight bulky, which I noticed they're coming out with some new five weights too, which is really nice for the winter time. This color is called light blue, but I, it looks a little more on the gray side, so it's definitely a gray blue, but I really like it. Very nice. Very super, super soft. Definitely don't feel the wool at all. The mohair probably softens it up very nicely. Look at that. That is just beautiful. This one is really, really pretty. This is Wool Cord DK. This is a three lightweight. This is a 50 gram ball, 130 meters. And it is 40% wool and 40% acrylic. I love these. This, this is gorgeous. It's again, a bluish gray. Looks like there's some blue and gray wound in together with the browns. I really like this a lot. Very nicely wound. A little bit of fuzz, not very much. There is some. Not super long. Very pretty yarn. Now this is not a new yarn, but it is a hot yarn. So this is one of the hot sellers this month. And that's because it's perfect for holiday projects. This is an off-white chenille, which is almost completely white, with silver running through it. And it is great for all your winter and holiday projects. This is a three-weight chenille that is off-white, which is almost completely white. So I'm going to say it's barely off-white. But it has silver metallic thread running through it, which is so perfect for this time of year for all of your holiday projects. Just had to show it to you. I did get a bunch of this in stock on Yarn Nut because they were running out of it on ice pretty quickly. It's a really good price, and this is super yarn. It's a chenille blanket yarn, but it is a lightweight, as you can see. It's very, very sparkly. This is kind of a flat thread. Part of my heater now. There's not much I can do about that noise. It's cold here. We got our first snow yesterday. A little dusting of snow in the morning, so <sighs> winter's coming. This is a flat thread, but it is very soft. I'm not going to say it's super cushy, cushy soft because um, it's not, but it is not irritating and it's beautiful. It would make nice scarves, nice um, hats. You can also do placemats with it, tree skirts. I think it makes some really, actually makes some really cool snowman, snowman. If you're into the amigurumi, which if I said that right, I haven't done yet, but that yeah, looks really great. This is another new yarn just in time for the holidays. This is Baby Will Glitz in the Ecru color, and it's Ecru yarn with gold metallic thread. Again, I love these colors. Baby Will Glitz is 30% wool, 67% acrylic, and 3% metallic. 
super amazingly soft. Um, I'm not feeling any irritation from the wool. This is a 100 gram ball and 174 yards per ball. It, this is very nice comfy yarn. Very little bit of fuzz. It's loosely spun. This is the new snowflake yarn. This is the time of year for those pom-pom slub yarns. It's so fun to use them in this winter time because it just makes you feel warm and cozy. This is the white, pink, salmon, yellow, green colorway, and it's number 68017. This is a 100 gram ball, 3.53 ounces, 191 yards per ball, and it's a four weight medium. So this yarn has green, yellow, orange, coral, lavender pom-poms, all just beautiful. This is what it looks like. It's not very fuzzy. Um, the body bond I'll show you is much fuzzier. This one just got a little bit of fuzz, slight sheen to it. This is gorgeous. This would make some really, really pretty blankets or garments. Now I wanted to show it to you next to the body bond because the body bond is also a four weight, but it's much fuzzier. This is the body bond. Now they just came out with a bunch of new colors in the body bond. It's not a new yarn, but they were down to just two colors not too long ago. So they recently just released a bunch of new colors in this yarn and it's a little bit different. It looks a lot like the snowflake, but it is much fuzzier. Here, we'll put it the snowflake there so you can see. Snowflake is at the top, Bonnie Bon in the salmon shades is on the bottom, and then the blue white shades are in the middle. And let's take a look at that yarn. Again, it has the same shape pom poms as you can see, but it's much, much fuzzier. So if you want something a little more warm and cozy, fuzzy, then you're going to want to go with the Bonnie Bon. They have a bunch of gorgeous colorways now. Fair amount of fuzz there, and it's much softer than the snowflake just because of the amount of fuzz and the bonnie bond is 50 percent polyamide 40 percent premium acrylic and 10 percent polyester and the snowflake is i'll have to put that up on the screen because that label is also cut off then i wanted to compare those yarns with the puppy pom-pom puppy pom-pom is more of a chenille and it has smaller pom-poms in it A lot of gorgeous colorways too. So the puppy pom-pom is going to be a little bit different than the bonnie bon or the snowflake. It's more of a chenille dairy look. Again, super soft though. Just depends on what kind of look you're going for. This is another hot yarn this month. It's not new, but it's very hot. As you can see, the colors are hot, hot, hot. This is Kid Mohair Flamme, if I'm saying it correctly. 37% Kid Mohair, 45% acrylic, 28% polyamide. It's a 30 gram ball, 250 meters, and it is a one fine. This is a thin thread with some fuzzy attached to it. And the definition of flamme is basically two fibers put together. I looked that up. <laughs> so this, if you don't want to use it this thin, I would double it up. Or I would pair it with maybe a brown or a cream and just add that as an accent color on with that yarn. So I'm going to have to play around with that. I'll show you what I end up doing with it. This is also in stock on yarnnet.com. So if you're in love with these colors like I am, you can go over there and check it out. It'll be a really good price for you. This is corals and hot pinks and burgundies, oranges, gold. It's just really pretty. It does stick to itself really well. So you gotta, I'm not sure it would frog really well, but maybe if you put it with another yarn, it'll be better. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? I fell in love with these colors. I'm like, oh, gotta have that. <laughs> And what is this big hunk and cone? I haven't seen cones at ice before. I mean, maybe they had them, but I certainly haven't seen them. This is baby gold cone in the cream color, number 67626. Who doesn't love a big spool of yarn? Look at this. It's pretty amazing. Baby gold cone. It's a two weight fine. It is a 400 gram skein and 2000 meters and it's 100% acrylic. It's a really nice size cone. Super soft, very nice yarn. I love the fact that they're getting larger skeins in. This is so great. Slight 
halo. Just a little bit of fuzz. Nicely spun. To basic acrylic yarn. But super soft. And it comes in a 2,000 meter cone, which is really cool. You can make lots of things with it. Another brand new yarn from Ice is Pure Cotton. This is a four weight, 50 gram ball. Oh, I don't like that. I really wish on the four weights, you know, that's really not a lot. But it is 100% cotton. And this yarn is super soft. It is definitely not your dishcloth cotton. It is really soft and it has a little slight sheen to it. If you can see in this light. There you go. Yarn is just gorgeous. What is this pile of loveliness right here? This is a brand new yarn called Night Star. I absolutely think it's amazing. This is a three weight DK. So it looks a lot like the cotton that we just saw, the metallic cotton, but this is 7% viscose, 17% wool, 20% acrylic, and 56% metallic lorix. So it's actually 56% metallic, which what makes it so wonderfully sparkly. This is gorgeous yarn. In fact, my niece was here this weekend and I have to make her a poncho with four of the blues and the silvers. So that's how much she loved it. Out of all the yarn that I have, she picked that one. So this is a really exciting new yarn. This comes in 50 gram balls, 1.76 ounces, 218 yards per ball. And I think the colors are great. The only thing that I was disappointed about for the holidays was that they didn't have a green because, you know, green is a big color for the holidays. But um, other than that, they have a bunch of gorgeous colors. Let's take a look at them more closely. This one is the red black. This is red metallic with a black, slightly fuzzy thread over it. This yarn is so amazing that they're already selling out and it just came out. So I do have a few balls in stock on Yarn Nut. So if you want to take a look there, but um, look at that shine. It is just gorgeous. I love this yarn. This is what they're calling their pink. Now I'm finding this to be a little more on the mob side, not true, true pink, but they have a light pink and a regular pink. And again, this is a pinky, purpley, metallic thread with the matching color over it. Sparkle is gorgeous. It's very soft and not irritating at all. You can feel a little bit of the metallic, but it's not irritating. Here I have the light gold and the light gray silver. I thought these were great for the holidays as well. And super soft. Just amazing. You look at these fibers on the silver and gold. Look at that shine. Ooh, we just gorgeous. Very, very small amount of fuzz. Beautiful. We have copper and red. Here we have blue and blue silver. We do have a lot of these colors in stock on yarnnut.com because ice is already out of some. That's how fast this yarn is selling because it's so gorgeous. Here we have black pink and black turquoise. Again, the pink looks more to me like a mauvey, pinky, purpley. The turquoise is true turquoise. That. And these are both metallic thread in the color with black thread over it. Gives you a little bit more muted tones. And then finally we have plain black. Now again, the dark colors aren't going to reflect quite as much as the light because they don't pick up light with the dark colors. But again, this is really nice for an evening wrap, maybe for New Year's Eve. Super soft, very pretty. And the fiber on the black, maybe you can see that a little bit better than the other colors. Let's take a look. There's a little bit on the thread there. There's a little bit of shine on the thread, but it's really hard to pick it up because it's so small. Here's a nice furry yarn for winter. This is the Panda Duo in the light gray. 
This is 100% microfiber. It is a six weight bulky. I'm sorry, it's a six super bulky and it's 100 gram skein. This is a little bit cream and gray shades. Really nice. Super soft. Oh my goodness. This is great. And this is like a blanket yarn, chenille fur. Really pretty. Super, super soft. Loving the colors. Looks like the uh, one side is longer than the other. That should make something really, really pretty. I already showed you the Cakes Fluffy in the green, blue, yellow, orange colorway, but I got one in the browns and grays, and I wanted to show it to you. This Cakes Fluffy is a five bulky, 150 gram skein, 105 meters. This is 5% mohair and 95% premium acrylic. I love this. I'm making a robe out of the other colorway that looks like a rainbow and my husband liked it so much that he wants a sweater made out of it. So I'm going to make him a sweater out of the browns and grays. This yarn is one of my favorites. Now I do have sensitivity to wool, but working with this yarn with the mohair, it has a little bit of mohair in it. It doesn't irritate me at all. I've been um, working with it for quite a while now on my robe. So what the fiber looks like. Very, very fuzzy. Very, very soft. Easy to work with. And actually, it does frog very well. I've already tried that. <laughs> so. This is beautiful. I love these colors. And I really love this yarn. It's another one that's selling out very quickly. You know, these color changes are random. So that's why you're not seeing stripes in the cake. It kind of changes at random. So you have a more um, soft changes. And they blend into each other. You're not going to get... Um, you can get some stripes from it, but um, it's not going to be uniform color stripes. In fact, I can show you my swatch, my robe that I'm making with the other color. Hold on, I'll show you. This is my robe that I'm making with the Cakes Fluffy. This is that um, orange, yellow, purple, blue colorway. It looks just, I'll put the number up on the screen. It looks a lot like the rainbow. I'm not sure what the difference is. But um, this stitch is a linked triple crochet, which is really neat because it's actually making these bands. As you turn it, on one side it has bands. This is where the links are for the triple crochet. And then this side is the regular side. The other side shows like regular triple crochets. So it's actually making bands of color, which I think looks really neat. So this is going to be a robe, and I'll, I'll show you when I get a little bit further. But this is what the Cakes Fluffy works up like, and it's just a dream to work with. I love it. It works up really fast because it's so thick, and it does frog super well. So I give this yarn a really, really high grade as well. I know that everybody was getting disappointed because Ice was running out of colors on the Saver 100 and the Saver, and you'll be happy to know that they've brought out a ton of colors on both the Saver and the Saver 100, and now they've come up with Saver 400. This is a 400 gram skein. This is so awesome. Again, I think they're, they've really been listening to their customers who really don't like the small yarn balls because it just doesn't seem to be a good value. So this is Saver 400, 68083 in black. The Saver 400 is... 400 gram skein, as I said, 14.11 ounces per ball, 660 meters and 721 yards. That's so great. What a great value. This is 100% Draylon acrylic. And it is a four weight. Very super soft. I love this yarn. This is great. It's got a slight bit of fuzz on it. Very nicely woven. Very soft. This is a great basic yarn. Really nice hefty skein. We also have some other yarn on our website that is 14 and 12 ounce skeins, and that's our Darice line. It's a basic acrylic as well, so you should check that out if you're interested in this type of yarn. The Eyelash 100 gram in black. This is a considered a five bulky, and this is 150 meter skein, and it's 100% polyester. This is great for trims and uh just adding with another yarn to make it fun. Look at that. So cool. And then the white is just regular eyelash. It's a 50 gram ball. It's also a five. And it's 75 meters, 100% polyester. 
looks really pretty. How fun is that? And again, you can use it for trim or you can use it with another yarn to add some fun to it. They have the same materials, 100% polyester. I think they're exactly the same. The 100 gram is just a larger skein. Another new yarn. It's not really a yarn. I want to say it's more of a metallic cord that I thought would be great for the holidays. This is metallic cotton. And this is a one weight, super fine, 200 gram spool with 800 meters on it. And I will have to put the material up on the screen because I can't read the label. But this is number 66887. And this is super, super metallic-y. Like I said, it's more of a cord. But look at the shine on that. Look at that. That's incredible. This would be really nice to add with your yarn to make a metallic -y trim. Look at that. That's just gorgeous. All shine. Nothing but shine. This Camilla cotton is a two weight fine and it is 100% mercerized cotton. 50 gram ball, 125 meters. Two weight fine. So you can see the slight sheen it's super soft i just love it with no fuzz whatsoever to be seen at all and i'm sorry against the white against the white that's kind of um tough to see let's see let's put this black down here and see if you can see the white thread a little bit better as you can see no fuzz at all and it's just really pretty, pretty yarn. Wow, wasn't that a lot of beautiful, beautiful yarn? Thank you for sharing it with me. I just have so much fun showing it to you. Which one was your favorite? Let me know in the comments below. I'd be really curious to see. I'm having a hard time picking a favorite, but I think the one I really want to get my hands on right now is that Puzzle Baby. I want to see how that works up into a blanket, so that might be coming up in a whip really soon. <laughs> so if you have any questions about any of the yarn, please feel free to email me at yarn at yarnnet.com or put your question in the comments below. I do read and respond to all your comments. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day or evening wherever you are and hope you don't have a lot of frogging this week. <laughs> Bye. Oh, and don't forget to start those Christmas projects. It's time. I have to get started on my Christmas ornament crochet along, which will be coming soon. Have a great day. Bye.